What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Kios, aka You Know Better. Today's story is hilarious, bro. I guarantee you guys, you're going, you're going to laugh. If you do laugh, please hit that subscribe button. Cause I got plenty more videos to come. So, this story took place at work. I know every story so far took place at work, and a lot of shit happened at my job, bro. I'm talking about a lot, like fights and shit like that. People just got, people got caught stealing. And I'm watching it on the camera. It's just it's hilarious, bro. But um, today. It was Thanksgiving, and of course, me and Quan had to do our aisles and shit. We always do that shit. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure you guys are tired of hearing that part, but um, it was Thanksgiving. Hit like 9:30. We and Quan went to go uh, low seasons and shit. We bought, we bought, um, we bought pizza. <laughs> and this, you already see me about to start laughing. This shit's hilarious, bro. And there's this dude on on shopping carts name. Um, his name was Anthony. So on the way to Little Little Caesars, I asked Quan, "My yo, why Anthony walking like that, bro?" And he like, "I don't fucking know. I'm not worried about that, man. I'm just trying to get my pizzas and shit." You mean Quan get pizzas all the time, or it'll be cookies and shit for for our breaks and shit. But uh, we went and grabbed their shit. And we see, <laughs> we, we see our man. We see what's his name. <laughs> we see uh, fucking day Anthony. He rushing to put the fucking cart to the side and shit. So I'm like, well, uh, Quan, what's wrong with your man's? Cause Quan ain't want to clear this his man's. But he, he's like, that's not my man's, bro. Don't call that man my man's ever again. So we went upstairs and shit. We chilling. We on break. Quan called one of his shorties and shit. We ain't never clock on break. It's not how me Quan do. We still, we just milking the clock, bro. 20 minutes passed by. We still ain't clock on break. I'm like, bro, we got to clock on now. So we went to go clock on. And we was eating the, the uh, pizzas and shit. We had breadsticks and, and um, we had a juice. I forgot what type of juice we had. It don't matter. We had juice. We had the pizzas and breadsticks and shit. So we see, we see Anthony come up the steps, bro. No, no, we ain't see him from the steps. You can't see the steps, but we see him coming down the hall, and we see Anthony. He chilling and shit. He, he like, he holding his ass, bro. So Ant holding his ass, bro, and all you hear is him farting, bro. And he, you can just see his face. He got all the sweat down his face, bro. You hear him fart, crying like, what the fuck? So the shorty Quan on the phone with, cause Quan had her on speaker and shit. She heard all that. She heard the, she heard them farting. She's like, oh, who that farting? And then Quan like, oh, he over there farting. I'm like, oh, Aunt, is you good, bro? So Aunt just sitting there, he grabbing his ass, and all you see is this shit come out his pants, bro. He didn't have, um, he didn't have pants on. He had shorts, but all you see is these, all you see is shit hitting his socks and this fucking, this hitting the floor, bam. So I'm like, yo, Quan, this nigga just shitted himself, bro. So now Ant, he's just sitting there gripping his ass, bro. And I'm talking about, like, shit is still falling on this man's legs, bro. Dripping from his legs down to his socks, bro. I'm talking about, oh, my God. And he gripping his ass. And I feel like that's worse. Because you ever see how a, a baby, when they shit and they diapers and they sit down and they diapers, all that shit could go up their ass and shit? So I'm thinking, like, yo, when you squeezing your ass like that, ain't you pushing all that shit on your ass cheeks, bro? So Ant finally goes in the bathroom, bro. And, like, you can still see shit falling from this man's ass to the ground, bro. I don't know what the fuck he ate that day, but man was straight shitting out a lot of shits, bro. And this lady walks by. She didn't see the shit on the fucking floor. So she steps on that shit and goes right to the bathroom. She didn't even know she stepped on it. She thought, I don't know if she thought it was fucking pudding or some shit, bro. Because you can smell that shit the second you walk next to it. And she in the bathroom. She's like, what the fuck is that smell? She's like, did I step on shit? What when, when the hell did I step on shit? Oh, she's going crazy and shit. <clears throat> so she's going crazy and she's like, when the fuck did I step on shit? Da -da -da -da. And then uh somebody went and got the manager Joe. So Joe came and he he's like, who who the fuck step who who the fuck shit on the fucking floor? So we like, uh Ant that he's in the bathroom. He opened the door and he sees a whole big pile of shit on the fucking floor, bro. So he's he, Joe got mad. So he went downstairs and got Brian. Now, the story about Brian, bro, everybody bitches Brian, bro. I got a whole bunch of stories about Brian being bitched about Joe, me, everybody in that job. So, so Joe went and got Brian <clears throat> and told him, I want this shit cleaned up now. So, I, I made it to a joke. I'm like, Brian, you get it? He want this shit 
to be cleaned up now. So Brian got mad. He's like, yo, I'm not in the mood for it, man. I'm not in the mood for it. So Quan was like, Quan had to put his two-piece in there. He's like, you ever thought when you get this maintenance job, you'll be cleaning up another man's shit? Like, your mom's going go in there and go clean his ass. Like, wipe his ass for him. So Brian getting mad. And Quan was like, I don't give a fuck you get mad. So we sitting there laughing at him because this shit is hilarious, bro. So Brian, he 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 went and got, he went and got a, um a cardboard box, bro, and he cut it into two, and he cleaned the dude's shit up and put it in the, in the fucking trash. So I'm laughing at him, like yo, that's that's disgusting, bro. I would've been quit. I would've quit right there. I would've never cleaned another man's shit like that. Why, well, like I would've asked Joe to tell him to do it. He wasn't shit on the fucking floor and shit. So you hear Ant in the background still, you know, screaming his ass off, just ripping ass. So. Quan like, damn, Brian, you really out here clean another man's ass, basically. Like, you must go in there and go wipe his ass for him and all that. So I'm laughing. Brian getting mad, but we know Brian pussy, so he not gonna do nothing. So, uh, what's it called? Ant finally got done. So, Joe, I don't know what happened to Ant, bro, because he never came back to work. I guess everybody said that Ant, they, they switched him to a new shop, right? But, but I think that man quit, bro. But look, so remember I told you it was a whole big pile of shit inside the bathroom? So Brian had to go clean that shit. So this word this word the story got even further, bro. <laughs> so he was cleaning it with a bop. This is this the worst part about it. Somebody didn't know there was shit in the floor. Nobody told him. And Brian dumbass had the mop bucket right next to the door. And yo, I, I kid you not. So the dude, he was mad because he's a cashier. So he came and slammed the door and hit the bucket and the bucket, the, all the shit water hit the fucking floor and some of them splashed on Brian's clothes. I guess he didn't know. But then, but then I just started dying and Joe come back up and said, what the fuck is you doing, Brian? What, 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 what are you doing? He like, Brian, like the dude just fucking knocked the whole, the whole thing off. And then Joe started getting mad. He's like, yo, clean all this shit the fuck up. Da -da 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 -da. I don't know. I forgot what he said because Joe get mad. His face turned red. Joe was a fat motherfucker, bro. He like, he liked that fucking character that was in a uh, movie Ratatouille that the, the, the dude he he had looked up to, the big the big fat chef. That's how Joe looked like, bro. But so he getting mad at Brian. He cursing him out, and he was like, "What are y'all doing?" I'm like, "We going on? Uh, we getting off break?" He said, "Yeah, uh huh. Yeah, uh, yeah, um, yeah, um, what he say? He said, yeah, um, milk in the clock again, right?" You know, Joe always knew we milked the clock. As long as we gave him a pizza, he never said nothing. We know he fat. So, uh, so Brian now he got he got shit water on him. And he cleaned the uh, upstairs. I mean, he cleaned the bathroom. He had to remop all the water and all that shit. So look, that's where the funny part is. Some lady broke something downstairs, and Brian was the only maintenance man that day because the other man dude called out. He knew what it was. It's Thanksgiving. He's not coming to work. He called out. So Joe forgot Brian got to clean upstairs now. He called Brian back downstairs. So Brian getting mad. He went. The lady, she broke a glass jar of, um, what was it? Not ketchup. Fuck. Oh, tomato. So she broke, she broke a glass jar of that and some glass jar of onions. So that shit already stinked. So, um, Brian had to go there. And it was his dude cuz he was mad cuz the, the um he was mad of the um just the fucking the the, the line so he he gets there and I'm like yo Quan look 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 Brian don't know he got shit water on him bro so the dude he had a kid he had a baby probably like a couple months old so he starts smelling his baby's diapers and shit so I'm like yo Quan look so he like what the fuck is that smell he getting mad he's like what the fuck is that smell so he tells girls smell the baby's diapers and they don't smell nothing. So he turned, he turned back around. He turned back around, looked at Brian. He smelled. He smelled Brian. He was like, yo, you smell like. He said, yo, you smell like shit. It was, it was like, yo, you smell like shit. Get the fuck away from me. And like, yo, get the fuck away from me. You smell like shit. The Brian didn't know he was talking to him. <laughs> Brian didn't know he was talking to him at the time. So the dude was like, yo, I'm not going to tell you again, bro. I've been standing in this line for five minutes. Get the fuck away from me. I'm fucking you up. So Brian turned around like, are you talking to me? Yeah, who the fuck? Is I'm sorry. So the boy was like, yeah, who the fuck else I'm talking to? You smell like straight shit. So everybody started smelling it now because the dude pointed it out. 
So they like, yo, what the fuck is that smell? What's that smell? Smell like, smell like straight doo doo. And then Brian starts smelling his shirt. He's, he like, he know he smell like shit. So he, Brian, when I tell you Brian is pussy, bro, he got scared because the dude, what the dude was saying. So he, he stopped cleaning the, the mess and went back upstairs because he was mad. So Joe called him back downstairs like, hey, what the fuck are you doing? That's how you go clean that shit up. So he, he finally stood up for himself for a little bit. He was like, no, nah, I ain't talking shit about this. thing. ain't gonna fuck me up. So Joe will make it cut him off. He said, I don't give a fuck what he's saying. I told you go clean that shit up. You go clean that shit up. So Joe still smelled the shit. <laughs> he didn't say anything to Brian left. He's like, what the fuck is that smell? What do y'all stop throwing the shit? Like, nah. I'm like, do you remember how the, the, uh, the water spilled? Brian got the water on his shirt and shit. You'll see them stains in the back of his shirt. He said, oh, damn. So the dude... Brian went back over there to clean this shit up. Now it's a lady. The dude, the dude who's, who's cursing out Brian is, is up front now. He's cashing. He's, you know, he's, basically the lady's bagging all this food up. Now this other lady. I love black people, bro. They make shit dramatic, bro. They just make it loud so everybody else can hear it. So she like, she, she oh, baby, smelt it. She like, what the fuck is that smell? You can tell by her face what the fuck is that smell. But she smelled Brian like she actually walked up to him and smelled him. <laughs> and she was like, yo, you smell like shit. Loud, dumb loud. I'm louder than what I'm saying, bro. And she basically yelled that shit out. And Brian was like, I know, I know. She's like, you know you smell like shit, so why you come to work? What, you want to take a shower when you, when you come to work, bro? Like, oh my God, you really smell like shit. Like, what, you shit yourself? Like that. And you see the whole group of people just walked out. Like, that line was dumb long. It was so bad to the point they said, fuck the line. I'm going to a different line. Let's go to the back of the line. Bro, this story, bro, was just hilarious, bro. Brian was mad as fuck the whole day. His, his, his face was turning red. He was getting bullied by Joe. He wasn't getting bullied. He just can't stick up for himself. Bro, that was the story, bro. If you enjoyed the story, bro, please hit the likes. Please hit the like. Subscribe. Please comment. I got plenty more content to go. I, I upload one or three videos every week, bro. I always have content content on my page. And plus, I know the story was a little too long this time. Um, I got plenty more stories about Brian, bro. If y'all want to hear about Brian at ShopRite, how he, how he be getting bitched at, at ShopRite by everybody, bro, y'all just let me know in the comments. I got plenty of stories, bro. And I got plenty of uh, Joe, our manager, getting bitched, like, to the point where it is about to fuck him up at the, at the job. But yeah, like I said, hit the hit the subscribe button, bro. Smash the subscribe button, bro. Hit the um, turn on post notifications so you could be one of the few, like one of the first people to actually get the notification when I upload. Comment, like, share, do all that, guys. And um, I I um I um do live streams on Twitch. I'm gonna put the uh, link to the description down below so you could follow me if you like. And I'm gonna put my Instagram down below as well. I'm out, guys. I enjoy doing these videos for you. I enjoy making videos for all of you guys, all my subs, everybody who watches my views. Even though if you don't sub, I still enjoy making the views for you guys. I mean, the videos for you guys. I'm fucking up what I'm saying. It's like 4 o'clock in the morning. I'm doing this for you guys. But, yeah, guys, I'm out. Hopefully, you, hopefully you guys enjoy the rest of the video. I got plenty more gameplays coming out in the next couple of days. I'm out, guys. Peace. Thank you. Oh, if you go up here, get a little more of this. That, that makes us vulnerable a little bit, too. Round five. I'm hearing shots around five. I see a guy. Uh, 70. <laughs> Hit him once. He ran after that shot. There's a guy, there's a guy crawling on the floor. There's the guys behind us, 200. He's ducking. What number?
He almost killed me though. He was looking at me the whole time, bro. Coming towards us. Oh yeah, he threw that smoke. Did you down them? Somebody downed them. No, he didn't. No, no, he didn't. What the fuck? I hit him one time. That nigga's running. Two, 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 twenty. I can't see no more. Two, two. There's a guy right in front of me, two fifteen, but I can't see him because that dead hill dip. Hold on, I'm gonna see if I can get him from here. Yeah, this kid is two, 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 two thirty. He's, he's peeking. Nah, right here in front of me. See him? Got him. I killed him. I got him. I got him. I got him. Somebody else is shooting at me too, though. There's a guy, this guy's behind me too on my left side. He's coming from 30. Somebody, somebody's pushing. Yeah, he's There's six people left. There was a guy to my right that kept shot shooting at me too. Oh, I'm gonna go ahead. I got 120. Yeah, come here. Where you at? Alright, I'm dropping it right here. I'm dropping it in like 40. What number? Yeah, I feel like there's somebody over there who kept shooting him from that side. I see another guy, 305. He's running towards that shack. There's two of them back there. There's three of them. The rest of the three is right in front of them. The rest of the three is right in front of us. Um, I don't think I do. I got nades. That's all I got. They got snipers too. I hit one of them. I got a headshot on him. They're gonna revive him though. They're reviving him. Fuck, that kid just hit me. Yeah, they're reviving ca Cabin Boy. Yeah, I got frags. But I got, I got smacked real quick.
They're in the smoke, they're in the smoke. I'm getting the high ground. Fuck, they dropped you. Coming to you now. My aim was fucked that time. <laughs> GG, bro. Had a clean headshot.